Okay, partner, this is... We were on our way to the Krakarov volcano in Russia. While looking over what little information I had on the final member of the Fiendish Five, I began to notice something. In the four parts of the Thievius Raccoonus recovered so far, several of the pictures depict a shadowy owl-like figure, which looks very similar to the police images of the mysterious clockwork. Is this a strange coincidence, or is there something I'm missing? Sly Cooper in the cold heart of hate. Alright guys, this is going to be the finale. Hello everyone, United Gamer here. Welcome back to more Let's Play Sly Cooper. In the finale of the finish, and my controls are inverted, and that's annoying to me. Let me actually see if I can change that. Controls. There we go. That should be better. There we go. Bingo! My scanners indicate the clockwork is holed up in that owl-shaped tower. First things first, we've got hostile robo-falcons at 12 o'clock, Sly. Okay, so these guys are going to be very annoying to take down. And right now, no, no, no! Okay, we're doing good. That's no tower, it's a giant death ray! Sly, take out those rocks or we're in trouble! Okay, so this is going to be a long kind of a level. There's going to be three parts to this, and pretty much, I think, until you actually get actually four. All right, I'm not going to shut up anymore. I need to talk because I have a lot of things to say for this finale, and these guys keep interrupting me. Um, and basic, so we're going to have a little few more parts to do. This is like the basically first part. Then we got a second, then we got a third, then we got a fourth. So it's going to be kind of a long finale. So, I mean, I'm actually considering to maybe put it in like the you know, like, uh, like, two parts or so. I'm not really sure right now, but that's just been a thought, you know. Oh, gosh. That was close. All right, so far, so good. We have not been destroyed, and the bad thing is we don't have a lucky charm, which is a bad thing. What do you need to say? Okay, well, I think I realize there's more. And this time, there's a lot of them. So far, so good, but not really. Oh, wow, I'm so... That's it, guys. All right, guys, I made it part one on my first try. That is awesome. I'm really proud of that, guys. And now we're going to go on to the second part of the finale. We've got to get through that security door on the far side of the cavern. The only way to unlock it is to analyze at least 60 of those hanging computers. Would have been easy to get at them if Murray hadn't thrashed our new turret. Yeah, won't be a problem. I can hack the computer's connection coupling so they'll fall to the ground. Then, Murray will have to run over them with the van. Okay, and Murray, remember to use our new battering ram by hitting the square button if anyone tries to keep you from those computers. Okay, so you're going to have to collect 60 of these things, but there's also these slug monsters trying to get them too so that's also going to be a problem they're really annoying trying to collect all your stupid battery things um this can be pretty difficult at first i tried to do this without even knowing you had a battering uh battering ram or whatever you want to call it and i was getting dominated but i mean you can kind of gonna understand why because well i didn't know i could actually destroy these guys so i'm just letting them you know all come in and take all my stuff and then at the same time they're all like Oh, you can destroy me, but you don't know it. And so far, we're doing so good. And I'm, if I get through all these on my first try, this is going to be the best finale of ever. I'm going to be so proud of that. But that's probably not going to happen, because there's just one part, and I really stink, suck at it. But um, the, That first part, I made it actually, I don't know if I made it look easy or not, depending on whosoever's watching this. Um, but that is not that easy of a thing. Uh, 
I actually had problems with that when I wasn't Let's Playing, so I'm really happy that, because it, it slows down the time you need to watch of the basic stuff so you can get to the actual boss fight. So, that's just one thing. I'm really glad I got through that in my first try, and this one, this one is really not too bad. It's kind of easy, actually. Um, you just basically want to drive around, hit as many of them as you can see, and make sure they don't get bunches at one time. If you actually want to, you can go through and destroy all of them first, and then come back and collect them, because it takes a while for them like, to respawn. Nice driving, Murray! Now we have enough data to open the security doors! Just past them is the control room to Clockwork's Death Ray Tower. I think it's time for some Cooper thieving and sabotage, don't you think, Sly? Careful, Sly! Those tiles are booby-trapped! You better get out of there! Hold on. That's Carmelita. She looks trapped. Serves that cop right. She's been dogging us from the start. It's just a misunderstanding. We've got to free her. Are you crazy, Sly? Clockwork probably stuck her there to trap you! But if I don't do anything, Carmelita's doomed. Besides, stealing just won't be any fun without her. Sly, your ridiculous raccoon logic sends shivers up my shell. But if you're determined to go through with this, that barrel will undoubtedly help. Though I have no idea how you'll get up there. Dude, a spire jump here, a rail slide there. I've done this a million times. Okay, guys, I'm sorry. We had a little glitch happen right there. But I'm here and I'm back. Uh, so I, like, fell through the floor into the lava, so it was kind of funny. But there's actually going to be five parts before you get the first, the final boss, because... They're trying to get you to where you get every little last part of the game into one little finale. Like, you you know, we played as um, Sly, you know, we got Murray, we got Sly again, and then we're going to have Bentley. So, that's just a little heads up, guys. And destroy this guy, and don't hit that. Jump into the barrel. What this barrel is going to be used for is going to be to not get hit by those lights and other things. But, what you have to do is you have to run, stop. There's going to be a little dart shooting at you, too. Um, so far, so good. Got to take it carefully. This part's not easy. I'm true. I really think you should just basically take this slow as you can. And so far, I am doing very well at this. Alright, guys. I legitimately made that on my first try. So proud of that. Sly Cooper, I should have known you were behind this. You got me wrong, Miss Fox. I'm here to rescue you. <laughs> you sentimental fool. Empathy has always been the downfall of the Cooper clan. I knew this was a trap. Looks like I'm going to have to do some fast and furious hacking to shut down that gas before Sly's brain is turned to cheese. Billy comes through. Haven't had to do this in a while. Okay, okay what you have to do right here is destroy the things, right get the little key things, and go to the next those. level. Those really pretty basic, but it's gonna be kind of difficult security. depending on if you like these or not. But well, looks like I triggered one of Clockwork's security it's gonna be kind of difficult. Do not get hit by those things. I'm pretty sure they're one hit kills, so you really don't want to get hit by those. And these things do break up, so I'm not doing too well right now. Uh, what you basically want to do is keep your distance, shoot them from afar, because they'll break up and come at you pretty much. I don't think you can destroy that guy in the middle, but if you can... Oh well, I'm not doing that. So I don't know how. Oh my gosh, I literally didn't see that right there. You're annoying guy, don't touch me, I only have two more life left anyway. Alright, there's one. Okay, so far I'm not doing too well, but I might be able to come through if I end up not getting hit by another thing until like maybe the last part. How many more are there? Seriously. That should be it. Yes. Okay, I did good on that part, and I think this is the last one right here, and I start off with that. That's beautiful. Okay, not doing too well, actually, but I can maybe come through if I destroy these and just don't get hit by that guy or any breaking pieces it's more or less of me 
running into broken pieces, as in that guy shooting darts at me. And I'm doing my best, but no, please don't, 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 don't. Why can't I destroy you so you can get out of my way? Okay, okay, I gotta get three more. Uh, okay, okay, two more. Come on, Bentley, come through with me. Come on, Bentley. Oh, no. Okay, I gotta get that. Go, go. Yes, yes. I'm the best. No code can stand before me. First try, guys. We're back to a daring rescue. Sly, I was wrong about you. Break me out of this force field by smashing its base, and I'll make it up to you somehow. And there's actually six parts, guys. I forgot to tell you that, or I forgot myself. We have to do this thing with Carmelita, then we're there. And we have a temporary truce. Speaks for itself. I don't get it, Cooper. I've hunted you for years, tried to throw you behind bars, but when you get a chance to leave me in a cage, you set me free. Why? Mm, Carmelita, we may be on opposite sides of the law, but you're not my enemy. Now, the homicidal robotic owl that built this death ray and nearly gassed us to death? That guy's on my list. I see your point. All right. Until Clockwork and his evil schemes are destroyed, I suggest we work together. Together at last. Huh, wait, I need that cane. It's been in my family for generations. Don't worry, Ringtail. I'll cover you while you get it back. If you can, make your way to the top of the death ring. I stashed my jetpack there before Clockwork nabbed me. Now that we're a team at all, I need to leave your side. Hold on. This truce is only temporary. Once we beat Clockwork, I'm coming after you. Really? Well, maybe I'll give you a 10 second head start. Okay, so Sly's getting the ladies. That's all nice and good. Okay, so right here you're gonna have to destroy the little slug monsters that are after Sly. And this should be got right here. There we go. And what you basically need is you want a lucky charm coming here. So what I did, I went ahead and just let him kill himself for like six times so we can get a lucky charm. So just in case if I screw up, I have a little thing to help pro help protect him. So that's the little strategy of mine. If you guys want to use that, that is really good. But don't get hit by the stupid owl. You know, there's another one coming right here. Okay, so so far we're so good, and you, I don't think you can actually shoot him, because when I was doing that little thing, I was trying to shoot him so we could hurry this up, and it wouldn't let me, so there should be a guy probably coming out there right there. Or no. Oh, you need me to destroy that? Okay. My bad. Alright, destroy this one too. And guy coming out of here, maybe? Eventually? Probably right here. Oh, Lord, I didn't, where did you come from? Go, Sly! Just run through it all! Yes, okay, I think that's it, everyone. So we completed this on our first try. We are doing so well in this finale. I, I, I mean, I'm shocked. But here we go, guys, the last part of the game, Sinking Peril. Where's Carmelita's jetpack right where she said it would be? The magnetronic support field for the death ray got destroyed as you were making a run for your cane. You'd better hurry. This whole thing is about to fall apart. I'm on it. Oh no, the whole thing's gonna fall apart. What do we ever do? Okay, but yes, you have to go get the super thing, Carmelita's little jetpack. And I don't even think I'm, I'm not even controlling this, guys. I didn't remember this at all, but. Okay, so guys, this part's gonna be very annoying. Um, I've been trying to practice a little bit, at least get my lucky charm. Um, cutting out probably all of that, because that. It was very annoying. For some reason, I kept... It wouldn't grab the claw or something. It was doing very stupid stuff. But the lava is always rising. So you gotta go. Like, you gotta be going pretty fast, pretty much. And see, like that. Oh, my God. You dumb idiot. See, I mean, it's so stupid. I mean, like that, I... I hit circle, and it says I didn't. So, that's what I'm talking about. Like, sometimes it'll say I didn't do it when I clearly did it. But, so, just go through it fast as you can. Sometimes, the, like, see, like, right there, the lava glitched. It's like, and it, 
for it's supposed to be the lava is always rising. For some reason, the lava really slowed down once I got hit right there. So maybe that's not always a bad thing to get hit. I don't know what else to really say, but um, this level is really kind of annoying. Uh, this whole finale is gonna be pretty annoying. It's it's not it's like the only hard part in the game in my opinion. Now right here in the last time I did this right, I didn't know where to go. Where on earth do I jump? Just on you? Okay, that works. Okay, here we go. Now it's the final thing: a strange reunion. 